<laughs> it's yes. very hard keeping up with the days, but it is Vlogmas Day 10, and we are doing a live stream today. So I'm just going to wait for uh, everything to catch up. If I just uh, refresh the screen, you should see, if you are here live, you should see the uh, comment section, uh, and you can also play that back on replay as well. Um, so as we are live, please ask us questions. We are here, um, and you can, you can yeah. be with us to do... You can ask us whatever you want. Yay. So I can see some people in the chat room already. Who can I see? Uh, I can see Torella Steele, Laurie Laurie, and we have lots of people dropping in. So the main uh, point of today, we are going to be doing a Cherries Ooh. haul. Um, so we've got 75 pounds worth of products and goodies in this box. Now, Matt doesn't know what I've ordered. No idea. It's always a surprise <laughs> to me. So we are going to unbox them, but we're also going to be doing a chat whilst we're doing it. So it'll be a kind of slow unboxing and comments yeah. in between. Hi, Julia. Hello, Mary. Hi, everyone. Hi. So because this is a really big box, uh, I'm going to put it on the chair once I've opened it initially. And then I can delve into it. Ooh, I'm excited. Yeah. Well, there are some there are some Christmas based things. Oh, so Christmas. Uh, so you will get to see some nice festive things. Some of it's not. Some of it's home product. Yeah. Um, by the way, we do have a discount code. We do, which is in the comments at the top at the top of the live chat. It's yeah. Elliot Match twenty five for twenty five percent off your first order. It's got to be over twenty pounds. Yeah, um, so I've left everything linked. You need to use our unique link. So it's in the description box. It's also in the in the chat comments as well. Oh, Laura's asked if I'm still doing my channel. I am. I've just hit a bit of a, well, it's been a bit of a weird few weeks. Yeah. But I'll probably be back in the new year. Yeah, so yeah. Matt will be back doing, be back. doing <laughs> weight loss yeah. and whatever else Matt wants to vlog about. <laughs> so just so you guys can see, this is what I've unboxed. Ooh. Uh, but Matt's not going to see it because oh. I want to surprise him. So I'm going to pop this down on the I chair. I white ball. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Well, like I say, it's, it's Christmas based. Uh, by the way, can you all hear us? We've got the microphones on. I'm just wondering, can you hear us okay? Um, hello to Dabby, Louise, Laura. Hi, everyone. Right, so the first thing I am going to show uh, Matt. Oh, hold your hands out and close your eyes. There we go. Woo, funky baubles. Yeah, these are, okay, so Cherries has lots of different sections, including Ooh. homeware and seasonal. And obviously it's Christmas. So, I've, feathered. so I've ordered three feathered baubles. Ooh. So obviously you can put them on the tree, but we are hosting a Boxing Day, Boxing Day yeah. Christmas dinner for our parents. So I was thinking these could actually go on the table as like Ooh. a table decoration, nice. but they are really, I was really, say, really there's cute. There's literally no room on our tray for these. No, <laughs> no, no. We've bought some new decorations as well, uh, but I think these are lovely, and they weren't very expensive. I can't remember exactly how much they were, but they were not very expensive. It was on a on a free for two. Okay. Um, so can you manage to put that back yeah. in there? So I just thought they were really, really, really nice. Uh, they are they are very glittery as well. Um, so we'll be covered in glitter today, won't we? Oh, sure. We'll have big sparkly hands. Just clean by this the, kitchen. By the way, after we've done this, I will be doing the advents for day 10. Um, and we're out tomorrow. We are. So I have pre-recorded advents for day 11, and that will be going out. So there won't be a normal premiere that we're attending okay. tomorrow. Um, but there will be a vlog going out. Okay, so carrying on the Christmas decoration Ooh. theme, what do you think about this? That's cute. It's I a think. glittered pine cone pick. Okay. So what they're actually for is to go in your tree. So uh, if you've got gaps in your tree, you put them in and they fill it up. Oh, but again, clever. I thought table decoration. Yeah. Uh, hello to Sarah, she just come in. And um, I thought table decoration. Because okay. why not? Why not just do a table yeah. decoration? Um, okay, so there's three things in a set here. Ooh, conditioner, shampoo, body mm. wash. So they've got they've got what they are written on, uh, which I think is rather good. So mm. 
Things look better in decanters, don't they? They do. So I thought, going in a very similar theme to what we've got in the kitchen, we've got the hand wash in a decanter. This one's actually from Ikea. Um, but I thought, when I saw them, they'd be really, really good for the bathroom in the shower. So you have... Um, no, we both share the same shampoo now. We did We did used to have different, didn't we? I still use mine. Do you still use Black that one? Stuff as okay. well. well, head and shoulders... <laughs> I think it's probably going to go in that one, yeah. just to decant it. it. It looks better on the shelf. The conditioner, we could put your one in there yeah, as well. Yeah, was on the left of mine. So I think those, let me just test the, um, oh, actually, that's quite a good pump because some of them don't feel very um, sturdy, Ooh, whereas that's that a feels... That's a robust pump. It is a robust pump. No, it is. It's, it's a firm pump. It's a robust pump, and if you look, that's kind of... So you can Ooh. shop all these items, like I said, uh, discount code Elliot Matt twenty five was it? Elliot and Matt twenty five. Follow Elliot Matt twenty five. Follow the link and you'll be able to shop these as well. Yay. If I can get it back on, <laughs> I've twisted it and now I can't get it back on. We do like a firm pump. There in you this go. Household. It wasn't on problem. We do like a very firm pump in this household. So I thought they were just very very nice. Um, Kimberly loves the pump and Louise says they're so sensible. Mm. And they're very easy to clean in white as well, which I thought was nice. Okay, ooh, now this is more for me than it is for you. <laughs> uh, are they tumble dryer ball things? Yeah. Are they okay? What are they supposed to do? They are tumble dryer balls. They are supposed to reduce drying time. Ooh. Don't okay. ask me how. You might know actually from being science-based. So they're little, I'll get one out. They are, um, there's two in a pack. They're like these little balls. And apparently you pop them in your tumble dryer and they whiz round and they reduce drying time. I don't know why. Is it to do with static or is it to do with... Is it a nice back massager as well? It also feels nice. Yeah, it does also <laughs> feel really, really nice. So I thought I'd give them a go. I haven't used them before. Please let me know if, if you've used something like this before. Also back up as a skin plumper. Yeah. Um, hello to Jay. Um, Laura says, I love how organised you are. It's an in inspiration. <laughs> I don't think we've been called an inspiration before. It's an inspiration unless you have to live with it. Uh, ooh, Maddie <laughs> says, they separate the clothing so it dries faster. Okay, well, I'm all for a bit of separation with my, with my laundry. <laughs> Not in real life, with my laundry. <laughs> so hopefully they'll be quite good. Yeah. They're in purple. I didn't get a choice of colour. I'm just covered in glitter. Oh, are you choice I of cleaned this kitchen this morning. <laughs> and now I'm covered in glitter. Okay, so... I'm also... I have, I have this but with, without a bottle at the moment. So I'm not sure where my bottle is. But we'll have to wait and see. Obviously, this is attached to a bottle. <laughs> Imagine if it's just that. Imagine if they just sent me this. No, we'll have to look out for the bottle. <laughs> okay, you'll like these. You'll, you'll, you'll like this. Ooh! Chocolate! Yeah, show what they are. So these are little... Yeah, so they also, do, Robin. they also do snacks and food. Uh, including chocolate and drinks. And, and dime bar Crisps things. and all sorts of things. Oh, they're like dime bars. Yeah. Oh, so these well, are I don't know. your thing. Oh, they just... I just thought they were just chocolate. No, honest. it's solid milk chocolate eggs with crunchy almond caramel pieces. Ooh! So you can have these. Oh, well, they're, they're, they're obviously more for me then. Because <laughs> you need more snacks. I need you have more. A cupboard full of snacks. I need his. more diet food. Like these are diet foods. Um, okay. Oh, Sarah Tully's used them. Did they? Did they work? Ooh. Uh, purple is Louise's favourite colour. And Gillian says, "I have hedgehog ones. They work well. Just hide in the washing." Okay. I'll, I will. I'm willing to give them a go. Ooh, what's that? Oh, a scrub mummy. So they do scrub mummies, scrub daddies. They're just really good. They don't scratch your pans. That's really good. So I don't know where people are. I'm not actually scratch daddies. Yeah. They are for household, kitchen, outdoor, bathroom, basically anything you want. They also do... Little cute smiley face. They oh, also she's do... She's got a bow. She's got a bow. Oh, she does have a little bow. Look. There. <laughs> um, they also do little caddies that you can stick to your inside of your sink. And they sell them on cherries. Mm. I, I didn't get one. So there's like a, a rough scouring side that doesn't scratch, and then there's more of a sponge side. You don't like the sponge, no. do you? The sound and the feel of a brand new dry sponge goes through me. See, I like it. Oh, you're gonna put it oh on look, you can, you can, we can make it talk. <laughs> 
I'll put the scrub mummy down. Thank there you. We go. Ooh. Right, she's she's gone. <laughs> <laughs> Those okay. things that just go through you. Ooh, mayo! We needed more mayo. We needed a mayo. Now, I actually really prefer the light mayo mm. to the full fat one because it's more tangy. So, tip, tip, real good tip if you do like tangy, get the light version uh, because it does. This is Hellman, so it's a really good, Yay. really good brand, and we do use it all the time. Um, so, I thought that would be really, really good. Okay. Ooh. Oh, a little list thing. Yeah, I thought this would be good for the kitchen. Yes, we're always looking for paper, aren't we? Yeah, so whenever we run out of any shopping, we can make a list of it. And we just it's... have to remember to take the list. Yeah, of it. oh yeah, because we, you, we made one and you didn't take it. I think it's over there somewhere. I have to remember everything. Um, so I just think this is a really handy size. Rather than using up a big page, you can just literally make a list. Hmm. So I thought that was really good. Uh, the paper feels quite nice. Uh, I think it's recycled paper, actually. So that's, that's a good one. Um, they also do, cherries also do lots of gifts as well. Yes. So. Yeah. Oh, Pamela's like me. She leaves lists in the car. <laughs> I'm not alone in this world. You're not alone. I mean, you've got the list as well. Yeah, but you made it. <laughs> you made the list. Okay. Tomato ketchup. Oh, it's that like proper chip shop ketchup. Yeah. It's really nice. These are sort of thick, rich, sweet and fruity. Ooh. Um, so we do love tomato ketchup, and that's a really good one. Like Matt said, it's like the ones that you find in the fish and chip shop. I didn't UK. know they put you in a bottle. What is it? Thick, rich. I hope you mean thick with Sweet. a. I hope you, I hope you mean thick with a double C. <laughs> a double C. Of course thick. I do. Um, hello to Tammy. Um, right. Ooh, something for Christmas table. Oh, you got a tablecloth. I did. Uh, this box. is, I, I, is it white clean? I don't know. Um, I don't know if it's one that you use more than once, but anyway, it will be used on Boxing Day because I don't have one. Do we need to get glitter then for it? A little confetti glittery thing? No, that's tacky. Doesn't your mum do it every year? No. Not every year. Well, no, it's not going on our table. Okay. I read somewhere in the Daily Mail what was tacky and what's not tacky on a Christmas table? The Daily Mail is Apparently, the table runners are out. Little glittery things are out. Um, what else was in? I don't. You should be simple and classy. Right. And apparently, red tablecloths are still in. Okay. This one, I'm hoping it's going to fit. It's 132 centimeters by 178. So there is also another section on cherries just for party wear. Yeah. Ooh, I believe Gail has seen the elf. Oh. Oh. Oh, where I don't, could I don't he be? <laughs> where, where on earth could he be? <laughs> Ooh. Oh, salad cream. We're running out of that. We sandwich. are running out of salad cream. So this, Heinz is a really good make in the UK. Um, Does this still have the royal warrant? It used uh, to. I can't see it. I, I can't see it. Oh, uh, maybe it's... Well, the Royal Warrant needs to change to the King Charles anyway. Yeah. But this one's no artificial colours, flavourings or preservatives, vegetarian and it's kosher. Oh. So there you go. Uh, per 100 grams, 303 calories. Wow. Is that good? And the whole thing is 605 grams. So you do the math. It's diet food. Woohoo. Okay. I still haven't found this bottle. Imagine if they just put the thing in without, ah! without the actual bottle. <gasps> Okay. Oh, these are mine. White jingly bells. <gasps> there we go. I've got snowballs. Yes. Are they snowballs? No, or they're bells? white jingly <gasps> bells. Everyone loves a jingly bell. They're just white chocolates. They're perfect for me because mm -hmm. I just like things plain. I don't like crunchy things. They don't eat my chocolates. No, it makes you go all funny, doesn't it? Mm. So that's those. They do look rather lovely. Uh, apparently, thanks to Coco Life, we are helping plantations to protect the forests around them. Mm. White with white jingly bells. Now I they've missed it. They should have called them white jingly balls, <laughs> shouldn't they? Because well, they just should snowballs. They could have been snowballs. Now, is there a royal warrant? There's a, wa a royal warrant on these. Look, mm. can you see it where my finger is? It's right there, uh, and it's still appointment to Her Majesty the Queen, I think. Her late Majesty the Queen, I should say. Um, Julia says, jingly bells, they look delicious, I'm sure they are. I can't wait to try them. Kimberly says, I didn't know that about a table runner. Well, apparently, 
the day da- the Daily Mail says <laughs> the table runners are tacking. So they take it up with the Daily Mail. Yes. Okay, there's a big there's a big package. Oh. A big package. What's in your big package? What is in my big package? Well, let's remove the outer wrappings and then we can reveal... Oh, it's more of those tub things. Yes, but if I show people the other, the other side, oh, that's yeah. what they're like. They're like these canisters and they're different sizes. And I With thought... With a tray. Yeah. So I thought it'd either be good for the bathroom or for the kitchen. In fact, the kitchen might be quite nice yeah. because we could put, your, you know, your herbal tea bags yeah. in one of them or... The sugar could go in, the tea yeah. bags. So there's two mini size and two two of the full size ones. So that's, like I say, that's what they look Ooh, like. They're handy. It's cork. So I, I think it's cork. Yes, yeah, bath, bath. It's sold as a bathroom cork storage set. I'm sure you could put it everywhere. I think it's good for the kitchen. In fact, I think we've seen other YouTubers who have um, had this and they've got theirs in the kitchen. Well, I've seen who's yeah. got it in the kitchen. <laughs> so, so yeah, I, and like I say, they've even displayed it with some bathroom things, like with um, the cotton buds and beauty blenders and all kinds of things. I just think that is really, yeah. really useful. Shall we get one out? Yeah, let's have a look at one. Shall we get it out? And... Ooh. Ooh, it's coming. Okay, Ooh. let's remove the, the packaging. They're actually really nice. Look, that's a, a little one. That's a big one. Are they plastic or glass? I think they're glass. They feel like glass to me. Yeah. Another little one. And there is the tr- the tray feels really solid and thick, actually. Oh. So let's pop them on and see what they look like. Oh, and they're all down, so you can yeah. do them all. Let's not off-balance mm. me. <laughs> there we go. So I think that's really good. Hmm. I can't remember how much it was, but like I say, all the stuff that we're unboxing today costs £75. So you get a lot of stuff for your money. Things Mm -hmm. are very affordable. Um, Maddie, thank you so much. Uh, Michael says, I'm amazed that you were serious about recording every day. I hope you take a reward day or a week off once New Year comes and goes. Oh, Vlogmas has been stressful. Well, no, it's been okay. It's just... It's just yesterday I hit a bump. You did. Well, it was I a big did bump. hit a bump. More like a wall. <laughs> you had to put me to bed. I did. I, did. <laughs> I know when you need to go for a nap. Mm. And you never listen to me. I try and I try and say no. I don't need a nap. And he does need a nap. And he wants a nap as well. I don't know why he's saying. <laughs> because no. I'm busy and I've got. I'm going to tilt my glasses so you can't see the reflection. Because I'm busy and I've got things to do <laughs> and I've got vlogmas to make. Oh my goodness. Anyway, Pamela's loving the canister set. Yeah, lovely. I think, I think we're going to use it in the kitchen. Yeah. I think nice. it's a nice kitchen. Because we've, we've already got some similar in the bathroom for the cotton buds and yeah. the um, cotton wool pads as well. Um, Michael says, naps rule. They do. I, I can't nap. I've been up since 10 to 5 this morning. Oh, I forgot. I got, I got two sets Ooh. of them. So we've already, we've already shown these. It's, it's the Jingly Bells and the Little Robins. So we've got some more of those. Yay! Um, oh, a pencil case. Okay. I thought for our kitchen drawer to keep the uh, pens in, they're stop all them loose. Aren't yeah, they? this is. Uh, they do lots of accessories at Cherries. Ooh, and I thought yes. it's got like a little bit of a, a crocodile skin. A crocodile skin. It's not actual crocodile skin, people. I don't think I could afford it or even want it. But yes, it's got kind of this little gold zip. And I thought this would be really good. For just putting the pens in, uh, organising them in your kitchen drawer, because everyone has a messy kitchen drawer, don't they? Yes. Don't tell me you don't. We used to call it the dad drawer. <laughs> what was in your dad drawer? Oh, it was like screwdrivers, <laughs> batteries, you know, all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I just think that's nice, and I think yeah. it'll help keep out. So we know the pens are definitely in there. So I really like that. Laura agrees, naps are wonderful. Um, what else is that? Oh, no, I didn't think they were going to send these. Oh. Well, there's some things I ordered, and they sent me a message saying they were out of stock. Oh. Um, but here they are. Oh. I love them. They're, again, they're more decorations, but I thought you could use them on the table. Mm. Like little um, felt or fuzzy 
um, stars with, with beads. Yeah, I mean, I thought for like just lying on a table or, or hanging from the tree or you could put them on a wreath or you could have them just hanging. I don't know. I just quite liked them. I mean, yeah. you, could, you could, if you were inclined, you could wear them as earrings. You know, I mean, what, what do you think? I think, I think Pat Butcher would, um, would definitely approve of those. But no, there's supposed to be three of them, though. Oh, maybe that's why I thought it was about to stop Ah, okay. You had the last two. Yeah, I think I only have two uh, and not three. So, but I don't think they charged me for the, third. For the two. No, no, for the two. Oh. I, think, I don't think I was charged for that. Ooh, so. freebie. Okay, now this is for Christmas dinner. Oh, bread sauce. There we go. I'm not a fan of bread sauce. So but you for, are. Yeah, so for your Christmas dinner, you can get your bread sauce mix. I mean, you can make it yourself, but um, I think a sauce, a bread sauce mix is just as nice. Can I hear a bow? Yes. <laughs> so the bread sauce mix, if you don't know what it is, it's like a little white bread sauce. <laughs> and this is Coleman's again. They use recyclable paper packaging. So it's all very good for that one. Uh, yes, you could hang them on doorknobs. You could actually, or the, or the kitchen kitchen cabinets on the knobs. You can hang them on any knob. It doesn't really matter. Um, Lisa says, thank you both for working so hard to bring these Vlogmas vlogs to us on the daily. Merry Christmas to you both. Oh, Merry, Merry, Christmas. Merry Christmas to you too. Bo is amongst all the wrappings that we've thrown yeah. on the floor. Okay. Oh, I'll have these two Milky Bar festive friends. Yeah, we wanted some treats, some festive treats. What shapes are they in? They are in shapes of festive friends. There's <laughs> penguins, there's a reindeer, and there's a polar bear. Ooh, really cool. So they're really cute. I they're like those. They're really cute. They're super cute. And we've got some nice things to nibble on. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. these are for me. Although you might like them. I don't know they're chocolate yeah, chips. Do you like those? Yeah. Okay, well, that's good then. More for me. So these are the Maryland treats. Yes, double, yeah, chocolate, double chocolate, double chocolate chip for me. I used to get these for a lesson I used to do. What do you, what do you used to do? So towards the end of like year seven, it was all like mm. the fun stuff at the end of the summer, all but Christmas. I used to, because we still had to teach a proper lesson, I used to teach about, you know, making sure you've got the right equipment for the practical that you're doing. So I used to say we've all gone to the planet Cookie Tokyo. Oh yeah. And mm -hmm. the planet is completely powered electricity wise by chocolate chips. Yeah. Um, but so what I do when we do is I give them in pairs two cookies each. They get loads of tools to pick from, uh, and then they've got to break the cookie up and get as many chips as they can. And each chip is worth two hundred cookie dollars. Yeah. And see who gets the most. But then after we've done that the first time. Greta Thunberg's been on the phone. She's not happy with the amount of land damage there is with the cookies. <laughs> so then they have to use the tools to extract the chocolate chips without disrupting the cookie. No fracking for Greta. And me and my teaching assistant used to walk around the room when they were doing this bit. And if they broke the cookie, they got a fine <gasps> of 1,000 cookie dollars. <gasps> and it was to see who got the most. They got really into it. I bet. It's, it's quite a fun little party yeah. game, actually. We should try that. Yeah. <laughs> Mining the cookies. Oh, yeah. both oh, on the box. Hello, sweetie. He's in the box. He's now in the cherries box. <laughs> Bow. How did you get in there? How did you even do that? Oh, Bow. <laughs> Ooh, wrapping paper. Yeah. Oh, like proper brown paper. Yeah, I thought like for the old fashioned wrapping paper. Again, Daily Mail. Paper, it, it should be classy. Brown paper tied up with string. Who doesn't love a brown paper package tied up with string? Yeah. Bo, what are you doing? He's he's doing a, he's a, I mean, I'm going to have to show everyone. <laughs> Hang on. What are you doing, you monkey? Hello. What are you doing in there? What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing in our box? No, you can't start digging. We want to get a preview of everything that's in the box. No, they can't. It's all wrapped up. Oh. Bo. What are you, no, you can't go in there. He says, yes, I can. No, you cannot. Absolute terror. Oh my goodness. This is what we have to contend with on the daily basis. You can have the box in a minute, sweet. Right, but I need to get some things out. Okay. Ooh, 
Yeah. I, don't, I don't even know what this is. I totally forgot. Oh, it's another canister. Oh, it's another one. Yeah, another one. Not another one. Not another one. Well, this one is glass. I think the other ones are. Apparently. It doesn't really sound like glass. I, I think the other ones are as well, to be fair. Right, Bo, what are you doing, my sweet pink? Apparently it's oh. Right. And Laura says, Precious and he's so full of personality. He is definitely full <laughs> of personality. And Bo is just, ad- apparently you're adorable. Ugh. Until he starts screaming. Louise thinks you are adorable. That's what it is. Is it another one? Did I? No, I didn't get another one, did I? No, is it? Glass? Oh, I know. Christmas, Christmas cups. Ah! It's a cup of festive cheer. If you look on it, yeah, it's got <laughs> a cup of festive cheer. And I think I got two of them. Oh, well. that's cute. So there should be another one that's somewhere. Quite, that's quite big, actually. Is this, is this one? This might this might be one as well. A cup of festive cheer. Did they say the same thing? I can't remember. Oh, oh no, this, that's, a, that's, that's a, a bottle. Is that is that for the spray? Oh, I think it might be. Yeah. Oh, it's a glass yeah. one. I, I didn't realise it was glass. So we we now have found the the base. So do you know what I got this for? I thought a plant mister. Oh yeah. Or. A spritzer. Um, a spritzer for cleaning mm. products or disinfectant or something. Mm. Anyway, I just thought that was really, really nice. Yeah. So, I'm glad we found the bottom of it. Hello, Bo. What are you still doing down there? Oh, where's this other cup? I want to know if it says the same thing. Uh, it could be this one. It could be that one, maybe. <laughs> By the way, um, our link and code to get 25% off is in the description box. Um, for 25% off, Elliot Matt 25 is the code. You need to follow our link um, in. And uh, it's for your first order. 20 pounds. The, the same amount. Yeah. Your first order is a minimum spend of 20 pounds. Festive cheer. There we go. Oh, you're out of the box. Bo is now out of the box. So I thought those mugs were good. They're huge. Because there was something that I wanted to try in here. Oh, God. I'm not sure where it is. I don't think it's this one, but let me just... I don't even know what this is. I think it's a can... Is it a candle? No, no I, know, I know what oh, it is. Oh, I know what this is. Ah, uh, duck fat for roast potatoes. Yes, for Christmas Day. Yay! So, Cherries has got you covered. So, what's it say? Ideal for roasting meat and vegetables. There we go. I don't know if there's... <laughs> Well, per 100 grams, this is 900 calories. Diet food! Woohoo! Wow. I think that's really good. Wow. Very delicious and yummy. But it's completely free of sugar, so. There you go. And carbs, so. Every cloud has a if silver you're diabetic, lining. Treat food! <laughs> there we go. Um, ooh, what was this one? Mint sauce? Cranberry sauce? Oh, this is what I wanted the mugs for. Gingerbread coffee? Yes. Gingerbread coffee. Oh. Uh, but also, I thought these mugs would be good for my mulled wine or um, well, any festive drink. Any festive drink. I just thought they were lovely. So we've now got some mugs. And they're quite sturdy as well. They, yeah. aren't, they aren't the really thin ones. They are very sturdy. So I do like oh. them. What do you think? It's sugar-free and low-calorie. There you go. I've never tried a flavoured coffee before like that. Well, you can keep that one. We'll, we'll I love gingerbread. Okay. When you've been naughty. <gasps> Is it a serving platter? Yes. It's a paddle chopping board, but ah. you can lay things out, serve them, present food, make a display. I thought it'd look nice on the kitchen propped up. Beat your husband with it. A paddle. I mean, <laughs> you can row your boat with it. <laughs> I mean, whatever you want. I'm sure there's a million uses. So, yeah, I just thought that was a really good one. Um, the last item in the box is... I can't remember. What could it be? Oh, yes. Oh, cranberry sauce. I love cranberry I sauce. I hate cranberry sauce. I'm the sauce. only person in my family that likes cranberry sauce. Let us know in the comments, are, do, are you a cranberry sauce sort of person? Oh, I, I, I can have it on toast. Oh, I hate it. Oh, Louise, there's a charcuterie board. A charcuterie? Charcuterie. Charcuterie. Um, it's whatever you want it to be, and I'm sure we'll make... You've always wanted, like, a wooden board, haven't I you? I have. I don't know why. So I thought... I, I saw one on cherries. There we go. The box is now... Empty. Both empty. Shall I put it on the floor for him? 
I put it on the floor for him, and he'll like all this this paper as well. So I'll, yeah, I'll put, put some in. paper in for him. Um, he does enjoy that. He does. He loves paper, anything rustling, cardboard boxes, that sort of thing. So we'll leave that in, and all the cardboard will get recycled. Yeah. Laura says she's not a cranberry sauce person, but Pamela is. Kimberly's Julia. not. Julia's a cranberry sauce person. Uh, I hate it. There are dozens of us. <laughs> there, there are. There are dozens of you. Okay, so how long have we been live for? 30, 30 time to do the advents. So, Ooh, yes. so Matt's already, you've had yours I've had today, today, so it's just me doing mine. Does that mean I guess? Because I think I've seen you open. Tomorrow. Oh, yeah. hang on. Well, we'll see what it is. Hang on. Oh. Okay, I know the fact. The smallest Christmas card is invisible to the naked eye and was created by scientists in Glasgow. Oh, put that on your mantelpiece. Well, how's, what's the point if no one can see it? It's sometimes science isn't about why you should do something, it's just to prove that you can do something. Oh. Well, here is the chocolate. Oh, yes, that's the same as one I had this morning. Which is the a, Viennese Dulux. Ooh, a delicate and creamy cocoa filling encased in delicious milk chocolate and finely decorated with dark chocolate. He won't like it, so I'm going to have to eat it. Oh, too late. Can you imagine that? He does it every time he's worked somewhere for dinner. <laughs> mm. We go to a nice restaurant. Mm. And the first bite is that. No, I hated it. <laughs> Absolutely hated it. Disgusting. I will never eat it ever again. Um, L Goldman says yummy. Okay. Oh, there's so much so, stuff. Matt's never done one of these days of tea. No, I'm no. not a big, like, <laughs> made of tea fan. I just like tea. But I want you to try and sniff if you can get it right. So, we're on day 10, so I'm find the day. So there's the window, if you like. And here is a packet. So I've guessed these mostly right. Okay. Those of you that have been following the series will know that I've mostly got all of these right. You've got the schnoz of them. Bloodhound You've got then. to try and see what you Ooh. think. What do you think? What, what could it be? What's the flavour? Chocolate orange. Do you think? I think chocolate orange. There's like an aniseedy smell. Mm. That's not chocolate orange. I thought it was chocolate orange. There's something a bit medicinal. Mm. Like, um, what's that thing? An yeah, aniseed. There's nice. something aniseedy. And there's something aniseedy about it. I'm still saying chocolate orange. Ah! It was! Ah! I got aniseed from that. How did you get aniseed? I don't know. Right, is that, now smell it again, now you know what it is. Chocolate orange? Yeah, but I, I, I definitely get a, a more medicinal smell. Oh, no. So it's actually chocolate orange pura, 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 contains caffeine, cocoa husks, pura tea, beetroot flavour, cocoa beans, roasted chicory. It was a chicory I could smell. Um, is, is, is chicory a bit aniseedy? No, no I, think, I, I think it is. So I was getting one of the base, I was uh, getting an overwhelming of the mm. base scent. What's that, do you wine tasting? Uh, orange peel, rose hip scenes and orange blossom. Can someone tell me... Does chicory smell aniseedy? I think it does. Brew for three to four minutes. Uh, Pura, if you're new to it, it's an earthy black tea from China. It complements the cocoa and orange flavour well and a perfect warming treat. Maybe you're smelling the, the Pura. Pura. I think I'm convinced Pura. chicory has a bit of an aniseedy smell and that's what I was picking up. Pura. Definitely 100% what I was picking up. So, mm. there we go. That's mm. that one. That's that one done. How do you say it? Pew. 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 Okay, it's time for the Yankee. Ooh. 
been really enjoying these. Do I have to guess the scent on this one? Uh, no, it'll tell you because it'll be a votif, I think. I think. Ooh, where's no, where's, num where's number 10? Where's number 10? Oh, you found it. No, it, it, no, it's a little one. It's a tea light. Ooh. Do they smell? They do smell. I want to see if I can guess. I'll close but my eyes. I don't know. Well, I don't know because it, it doesn't have it written on it. What do you think it smells like? Winter's dream. <laughs> Winter's dream. Um, the little tea lights don't have anything on saying what they are. And I don't think they have it on the back either. Can, can you see anything on the back? Um, it's got... Or it, it's got something, but it, I don't. It doesn't I say. It says what's in there, but it doesn't say what they are. Whereas the actual votif candle does have it written on, so it would be helpful to for them to put a little sticker yeah. saying. Oh, okay, pointing at the bit going. Read this, and it's the bit that's all in French. <laughs> okay, well, read that bit then. <laughs> I've got my glasses, but yeah. So it's it's one of those, but it it doesn't help because it doesn't tell you what they are or what color they are. So. What do you think it is out of all those? I don't know, I can't read. Yeah, so <laughs> it's it's tricky to identify the tea lights, whereas with the votives, it's clearly got it written on. Apparently, uh, trickery is in our coffee in New Orleans. Mm. Uh, Ziggy says to you, Aww. you are so good for Elliot and he for you. Thank you. Uh, I love seeing the two of you together. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, thanks, Pam. Um, so there we go. That is all of Vlogmas Day 10. Now, before we go, I just want to explain why we're doing a live today. So we're having guests around today. We are. Matt's made a chilli. I have. So he spent all day doing I didn't that. vlog it because I, I woke up like starkly awake at 5am this morning and I've not been able to sleep no, since. You've been tired. And we've got to clean, <sighs> we've cleaned and tidied the house, although we do need to sort out the table behind us. Yeah. So we'll put all this stuff away and then finally finish tidying up there, set the table, have dinner party, have a good time, and then tomorrow, I haven't told them what we're doing, we are, we are going we to are be jettisoning. We are going to be filming two things Ooh. for two upcoming vlogs. Ooh. Um, so I have set, well I will be setting in a moment, um, a vlog for tomorrow, so there won't be a premiere, it will just go live, I think at probably 1 or 2 p.m. in the UK. Yeah. So do look out, it's very festive. Very, 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 very festive. So do keep a look out for that one. Right, so that's it. Yeah, don't forget to go onto the Cherries app, spend £20, use our code ELLIOTMATCH25 for 25% off. Yep. It's only for first-time customers, though, so, you know, do the thing. Wink. Yeah, just <laughs> get a new email or yeah. use someone else's email yeah. because then you will get the 25% off. Yeah, everyone's got more than one email address. <laughs> yeah, just so. use one that you haven't registered already yeah. and you'll get 25% off. And you can have as much beautiful stuff as what we have. So, if you've enjoyed this video and this vlogmas, please give it a big old thumbs up. Don't forget to share on social media. And of course, do hit the bell so that you know whenever we upload new videos. So from us, to you all, and goodbye.